Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be going over another jump rope review. We're going to be looking at the Punk Rope. It's a short handle 5mm PVC rope jump rope. We're going to be reviewing that today. But before we get into it, please hit that red subscribe button, hit the like button, and then after this video, share the channel with your family and friends. Alright, let's get into it. The first thing we're going to talk about today is quality. Now, quality is always the first thing that I go over with jump rope because if your rope is not of good quality, you're not going to get any good use out of it and then there's no point in jumping rope if you have a broken rope. This is a regular run-of-the-mill 5mm PVC rope, so the quality is as good as any other cheaper jump rope that you would get. There's nothing special about it. It does perform well. I have three of these that I use probably once or twice a week. None of them have broken yet. So, so far at the time of this recording, I have no complaints with the quality. It stands up well for the price that you pay for it. So I give this rope a five out of five jumps for quality. We're gonna talk about price to value. Price to value is important because depending on how expensive the rope is versus how much value you get from it, it's going to shape your opinion about the rope and you might be more or less likely to go back to that same manufacturer and buy another rope from them. So price to value is where this rope really shines. This rope is a cheaper rope and it goes for $8.89, I believe, on Punk Rope's website. That is a very fair price for this rope because it's, like I said, it's nothing special, but it doesn't need to be nothing spe anything special because of the value that it gives back. For $8, you get a ton of value out of this rope. I use this rope whenever I want to focus on basic jumps, alternate footsteps, anything workout related is when I use this rope because of the short handles and because it weighted a little bit more. And I use it when I don't want to use my cross rope when I don't want too much weight. So it's perfect for in that regard. So from a price to value standpoint for $8.89, even if it does break, which it hasn't broken on me yet, I really don't have a problem continuing to buy ropes for $8.89 because it's just not that much money for the value that it gives back to you. And this rope performs extremely well. So for price to value, I give this rope a five out of five jumps. Let's talk about performance. Now, from a performance standpoint, this rope does what you would expect it to do. For a short handle rope, you're not gonna be able to do any freestyle tricks or you're gonna be able to do a very little amount of freestyle tricks. But for this rope, the tricks that you can do, double unders, you can definitely do double unders with them, double under crosses, crossovers, running crossovers, side swings. This is a workout rope. This is a short handle rope. As I've said before, <clears throat> with the short handle ropes, you're going to be focused more on workouts and the basic to intermediate level tricks. With the tricks like the TJ triple cross or triple jumps or anything like that, it's going to be a lot harder to do with this rope. But for what this rope is designed for, I think that it performs extremely well. I've put it through numerous long workouts that you see on this channel. You see me using this rope and it shines under pressure. It shines under harsh conditions and long workouts. So from a performance standpoint, I give this rope a five out of five jumps. Versatility. Versatility is a really important metric because you want to be able to do a lot with the rope that you get. You don't want to have 50 different ropes for 50 different things you're trying to do. Versatility, this rope is very good. You can use it for working out, which is mainly what you should use it for, but you can also use it for improving your double unders because it has a thicker cord. And when you try to improve your double unders, you wanna use a rope that has a thicker cord so that you can get the momentum and so that you can get the muscle memory down. So then when you go to a lighter CrossFit rope, you'll have that muscle memory down. You'll be able to apply it in a harder context to a lighter rope because it's a lot harder to do double unders with a lighter rope. So you can work on your double under improvement with this, you can work on side swing improvement with this, and you can also 
jump backwards with this rope, which is also a really cool trick to learn. So this rope really shines. The only thing that it can't do from a versatility standpoint is the tougher tricks, like the triple jumps, any any freestyle tricks, arm wraps are kind of difficult to do with this. So from a versatility standpoint, I'd give this rope a four out of five jumps because you can't do everything with it, but you can do most things with it. So four out of five jumps for versatility. Ease of use. This is another area where the pump rope, short handle rope, really shines. As soon as you get it, it comes packaged in one of their packaging containers. You can take it out of the package and it's immediately ready to jump with. As you can see right here, I use two knots in my rope. I got a little bit of a longer rope and that's how you buy them on punkrope.com. You give them their your height and then they will size the rope according to your height. I think they have 411 to 55, 55 to 59, very similar to Crossropes, crossrope.com sizing metrics and sizing techniques. So when you get this rope, it's you don't have to boil it, you don't have to cut it, you don't have to do anything like that. All you need to do if it's too long for you is measure it out and then tie knots in it, which is what I do. And I tend to get a longer rope because you can always shorten a longer rope, but you can't make a short rope or a rope that's too short for you longer. So remember that when you're purchasing jump ropes is you always want to err on the side of caution and get a longer rope. So that's what I did when I got this punk rope and it works very well as far as that's concerned. From an ease of use standpoint, I give this a five out of five jumps because one of my pet peeves with jump ropes, as I've said before, is when you get it and you have to do all sorts of things to the jump rope before you can actually jump. So you have to boil it, you have to cut it, you don't have to do anything with the punk rope. So five out of five jumps for ease of use. Overall, this rope is very good. It's cheap, but it performs extremely well. And I also have a lot of respect for the folks that own this company. Tim Haft is a really good guy. He lives in New York City and he gives back to his community. I think he has a special going on where every rope he sells, he donates a rope to an economically disadvantaged kid. So you can't be mad at, at charitable efforts like that. You can't be mad at people that are using their business to try to give back to the community, to give back to people who are less fortunate than themselves. So that is also another factor in why I support punk, punk rope. But all that aside, this rope is a very good rope. It performs well. It's not as versatile as I would like it to be, but I don't think that that's what they're going for with this rope. With this rope, they're looking for a rope that they can give to beginners that's easy to use and that is effective. And punk rope, this punk rope right here, the short handle punk rope meets all those metrics and all those criteria. So overall, I would recommend buying this rope. If you're a beginner, definitely recommend buying this rope. And if you're an intermediate to advanced level user, you can use this rope for your workouts. You could use it to hone your skills and you can use it, especially for longer workouts where you're wanting a rope that's not too heavy, but that's just heavy enough to do your workouts. Hey, thanks a lot for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you haven't already, hit the like button, share the channel with your friends. What I strive to do with these reviews is always give you an honest review, and I only give reviews on products that I use. At the time of this recording, I'm not sponsored by anybody. I don't plan on being sponsored by anybody because my goal is to give you the honest review that you need when you're going out and thinking about purchasing a jump rope so that you can get the best out of your jump rope so that you can use what I think are the best products out there and so that you can continue to get after it, continue jumping rope and continuing to put your health and fitness first. So that is all I have for today. Go ahead, hit the subscribe button. Go over to www.jumpropevet.com. Get on the mailing list. You can get my free 30-day challenge. I'll email that straight to you if you subscribe to the mailing list. Check me out on social media. My handle is at Jump Rope Veteran. Instagram and Facebook are the two platforms that I'm normally on the most, and I will respond to you if you send me a message. So check me out on social media at Jump Broke Veteran. That's my handle for Facebook and Instagram. Until next time, I'll see everybody later. Jump Broke for Freedom. Peace out.